What's up guys? It is now Tuesday in the afternoon. I finished work several hours ago, quite a few hours ago, actually it's 2.25 right now. So I just wanted to give a quick update because I know I have not been filming that much the past couple days and I've still been like doing leg stuff. I've still been working out. I've still been doing stuff as I can and I should probably film, but anyway, I'm gonna try to keep this nice and short because I know I have a tendency to talk a lot, apparently. So I just wanted to give a quick update kind of where I'm at with my knee stuff. Um, I am encouraged yesterday, uh, I guess about yesterday, My I felt a lot better when I was in the pool walking yesterday evening. So I ended up walking the perimeter of my, King estimates it's about 25 meter pool, it's very long. Um, so I walked the perimeter three times, just about three times, almost which is exciting because I've never done that before. Like before I've pretty much just walked in a straight line like there and back and there and back. And it's been like fairly short things I would say, or it's like one, if it's the whole thing, it's like one there, one back kind of thing, like in a straight line. But I don't know. I just felt a lot better. Like by the end of that third lap, it was definitely taking a toll on my knee and it was getting kind of sore and tired for sure. But that was really exciting. And also uh, it felt a lot better as well. It felt a lot more natural than it had been, which is great. Balancing was also better on that leg in the pool yesterday than it has been before ever as well. So yeah, that was exciting. I felt really good. So I'm praying that I have another good day on Friday because that's my next PT session. <laughs> I would like good days between then and now. Um, sorry, between Monday and Friday as well. But yeah, that's kind of where I'm at right now. I don't really have too much else to talk about with my knee because I think really all that I know that's coming up is my next PT session. So I'll probably know a little bit more after that and I'm gonna see if I can get some footage, we will see. But yeah, I have that PT session and basically my goal now is I need to be able to walk and I need to be able to have very good mobility as well in my knee. So, because apparently I can't even like think about scheduling it with this doctor until all of that has happened. So that's kind of my goal right now. That's kind of all that I have to update you guys on. But I just wanted to update today because I know I haven't been lately. What's up guys? It is now Wednesday, like 7.30 something. No, not 7.30, 7 something, 7.10. Um, my first class got canceled. So I my first class is at 7.30 today. Um, so I'm downstairs, if you can't tell, which is exciting. I haven't been down here in so long because obviously it's been closed for months. Um, we woke up before our alarm because the electricity shut off for a while and literally the instant the electricity shuts off, it's so hot. Like I cannot, it like starts to give me a headache like really soon, really quick, really quickly. <laughs> after that and it's just not a good situation so um it wasn't like too much before our alarm but it was a little bit so it was like right before 5 30 when it shut up it actually shut off before that and then turned back on turned back on and then it shut off again but then it never turned it didn't turn back on for quite a while uh well like 10 20 minutes maybe somewhere in there Anyway, King brought me down here. Thankfully, King is off today, so he's able to because this has Wi-Fi down here and my Wi-Fi is still off and apparently it's going to be off for a while. So that's why I kind of had to like come down here. So um, I am happy to be down here. It's been so long and I missed, I really missed being able to see the pool and just like outside world <laughs> when I'm working. So that's exciting. I should have about like six classes today. Um, sorry, this angle is just annoying to hold it up. So I have to get set up because I just plopped my computer right here. I haven't done anything else. Um, King should get me coffee soon, thankfully, because I need it as always. <laughs> I'm an addict and I'm okay with it. I'm not really an addict, but anyway. So this is nice. I've really missed this. No one's in here which is so great. Today's a holiday, apparently. It's, I think it's a king's birthday or something, I don't know. Um, so literally no one's in here, so it's really nice. I love when literally no one's in here and I can just do whatever I want and be as loud as I want. Not that, I still try to be quiet because you never know if people like come in and they're in like corners and stuff I can't see, but I really like when no one's in here. It's really nice. <laughs> I 
to watch. I watched it last night and I don't know, just like, I just look horrible all the time. My face looks awful right now, whatever. Anyway, what I was trying to say, <laughs> it is actually really nice to be out of my little condo. I really miss this, but it's just not really possible for me to do it by myself because I can't carry that many things while I'm crutches. Hopefully soon, you know, if I'm able to start walking here soon and maybe I don't need crutches or something like that, um, then I'll actually be able to do a lot more because <laughs> then I'll actually be able to carry stuff rather than like, I can't carry a blooming thing. So, yeah, that's really nice to be down there. I also love sitting here and just like watching people walk or run by and being active in the back. That's really nice. I've always liked that, especially right now, I guess, because I can't do anything. So I haven't seen very many people. Um, I've been kind of locked away in my room, basically, unless I come down here to go to the pool or whatever. But it's just hard to spend much time outside right now. And I don't know. I really miss it. Maybe today, since King is off, we can do a little bit, but I think he has to run to macro real quick. I hope I don't have to go because I'm like, macro is just so annoying. All right, I have to teach fairly soon, but I am going to get set up. So I decided to go ahead and wear my brace down here just because I'm going to be sitting for a longer period of time than normal, or at least normal these days. So um, just kind of in case. King says the swelling has definitely gone down, so that's good. Hey guys, it is now the next day, Thursday, and I just finished teaching not too long ago. Um, I might have to take a break here because my friend might call me back. Um, so if that happens, it's gonna happen. But anyway, I wanted to quickly talk about my knee, how how it, how it is going, all that kind of stuff, just really quickly. So yesterday uh, was pretty good. I felt good while I was doing my mobility work for my leg exercises for physical therapy. Honestly, I was surprised at how well it was doing. But then I was going out to the living room and my condo is small, very small. And then King had like bags everywhere. I'm not blaming him. It's just, it's very small. And if there's even just a couple things, it's freaking hard to get around on crutches. So anyway, I was coming out here to watch something on the TV with him and, um, I don't know how it happened or why, and I feel like an idiot, but I lost my balance. And so I had to catch myself twice on my bad, bad leg, pretty hard, like very hard actually. And it was fine, it actually didn't hurt as bad as I thought it would, like it hurt, but not like a lot. And then this morning though, it just feels weird. Like the top of my knee, it's like a very odd place. I would, it's like up here, I think somewhere in there that is just, it's, it's a very weird kind of pain and it just hurts in a very odd place, but that's kind of what I'm dealing with today. So every time I move it, it's kind of painful and by kind of, I mean, really painful. <laughs> so that happened and I'm very you know frustrated about that, but some exciting things are about to happen. We are about to take a little mini trip because King has his first like actual break since starting his job. Um, it's called October break. It's basically their fall break and they have a whole week off, which is crazy, but we're not going for the whole week. His parents wanted to go just for a couple days for some reason. So, um, I'm still working next week, but just in the mornings like usual. Um, so that will be Tuesday to Thursday next week. And then we're also planning a trip with a few friends for the weekend after that. So in a couple weeks, and lots of things, which I'm excited to like end off October. Um, and I can't believe, yeah, then after that, it'll literally be November and we're like getting so close to the end of the year and hopefully to surgery. <laughs> That's what I'm hoping for. <laughs> anyway, I'm just sitting here now. I'm going to get some work done. Like I said, I think my friend might call me back. We're try trying to figure out plans for the weekend trip at the end of the month. So we shall see what happens with that. But yeah, I am just going to get some work done now, I guess. I'm enjoying watching stuff on the TV well, since I'm here by myself and can't do anything else. It's much better than watching it on my laptop. So, and I, I like to be off the bed for sure. Hey, so sorry for the terrible lighting. I feel like it's really dark because it's really dark outside today and whatever, it's almost four right now. It's like 3.40, I think. So I just thought I would give a quick update. I'm not feeling, I don't know, I'm feeling stuff. <laughs> 
Um, first of all, I told you about the whole, not falling, but like stumbling onto my leg thing. And then there's been a weird thing on the top part of my knee, like up here somewhere. Um, I told you about that. Well, today it's been feeling better. Like I haven't really noticed anything. I was just kind of like feeling around my knee, like here, not even up here, not intentionally anyway. I was kind of seeing if I could feel like where my knee, where the top part of my knee should be because minus all this crap right here. Um, and I accidentally, apparently touched the spot and it hurt so bad. I like, I, I like cried a little, which is odd and it threw me off and wasn't expecting that. Did not do that on purpose. I'm worried that something else is wrong. I, I don't really know at this point. It feels all right when I'm like walking on it. I'm walking on it with crutches and stuff like I have been and it feels okay. Um, I have PT tonight, so <sighs> we will see. I'm gonna try to have the energy to just be like, well, you know, I'm just probably gonna give the phone to King and be like, please <laughs> take as much video as you can, even if it's just like putting it in a spot and just leaving it. I. I don't really care. I don't really know what it's going to be like, but I do want that footage. Um, I think it'll be, it'll be really interesting and really helpful as well. Um, my physical therapist, we've already talked about it a little bit and she said it would be fine. So I have some things to look forward to, which is great. Like trip wise, I'm just, I think what is, <laughs> I don't know how to say this right now. I think my mindset is in this place where it is right now, which I'll explain in a second. But I think it's there because of the trips. Um, like, yeah, I'm excited and stuff and it's gonna be great. And I can't wait to like, just go anywhere, even if I don't get to like do that many things. But my headspace right now is, I don't know. I just feel sad and tired of not being able to do anything. And like King has next week off completely and I can't do anything. So like, what are we going to do? We are going away, but just for a couple of days like that, that'll be fun. And I'm excited for sure. But yeah, I'm just, I don't know. I'm the past couple of days. I have not been very productive at all. And by very, I mean like not productive. I I've done something. So it hasn't been like completely useless. And I've just, I've been bored and tired of being in my house all day by myself and not being able to do anything. <laughs> Um, so before when King was working and he was not here all day, uh, after we moved here, it was fine because I was downstairs literally all day, you know, like I worked out by myself. I worked in the co-working space. I worked outside by the pool and I just like chilled by the pool and then I went swimming and then I came back up here and then he would like be home, you know? So I was downstairs all the time. I was doing all the things and now I could do that because things are open again, but I can't do that because my leg, and I don't know. I think that's just hit me and I'm not trying to complain. I'm trying to keep in the best headspace that I can, but I also want to be honest about all that because I don't know. I just think it's a good idea to be as honest as possible about everything. And then that's why I've showed myself crying I've showed myself in all the unflattering angles and everything just to try to document this as best as I can so I don't know the past couple of days have been hard actually this whole week has been hard because this is the first week that King has gone into school like it was annoying before but at least he was here to like like when he wasn't working he was here to help me you know and even just like carrying things is exhausting by myself uh and Wednesday was nice because I got to be downstairs because he was here so he could help me carry things and help me like get around. And I really like that. Um, and that was really nice. But anyway, it is what it is. And this is my life right now. And I don't know. I just wanted to say basically that I am currently feeling very tired of just sitting here, not really doing that much. Like, yeah, I do my job in the morning. I do some other things I want to do, like vlogging and uh, editing and um, things for my PT client and stuff like that. Like I've been doing that stuff obviously in the afternoon, but yeah, I don't know. This is what it is. This is all I can do. And I feel tired of it. It's been, actually it's been almost seven weeks now. I think it's been, I think this is ending week six, which is insane. Like I honestly don't know how I've made it this far <laughs> this long. 
Um, like that's two months or almost two months. Like that's kind of crazy. That's really crazy. <laughs> so I've made it six, I almost said six months. So I've made it six weeks. I can make it some more. I'm just really praying that my leg cooperates and I'm able to walk. My range of motion improves so that I can get surgery. Just get that out of the way. We'll have to see though. Who knows? <laughs> Thank you.